Hello and welcome to my bioinformatics tutorial series. Uh, in the previous tutorial, uh, tutorial uh, we've uh, talked about a software uh, called the ORF Finder, which is uh, hosted uh, on the NCBI uh, web server. Uh, this software is uh, capable of uh, locating and uh, predicting uh, open reading frames or uh, coding uh, regions for uh, proteins. And uh, we've said also that uh, this uh, software is uh, very basic. So uh, we've used it uh, against uh, bacterial genome. Uh, in uh, today's tutorial, I'm going to talk about uh, a more sophisticated uh, program, which uh, is called uh, GeneMark. Uh, you may be asking why uh, the use of uh, this uh, software. Uh, well, uh, because uh, the simplest ORF protocols can uh, identify about only 80% of uh, protein coding uh, regions so uh, that's why uh, we've used it, uh, we've used it uh, or uh, the ORF finder we've used it uh, against uh, microbial genome because the higher uh, organisms uh, genes are uh, more complex okay uh, GeneMark is uh, uh, a family of uh, programs that use uh, very sophisticated uh, models that can uh, find very short uh, proteins that can identify uh, other start codons uh, other than uh, ATG uh, and uh, that can uh, predict uh, overlapping uh, regions as well okay uh, the first thing to do is uh, to go to Google as uh, usual and uh, we type our uh, software name which is GeneMark hit enter uh, as we can see here on the first uh, hit uh, gene mark is a family of gene prediction programs uh, developed at uh, Georgia Institute of Technology Atlanta okay we click on the first hit this is our main page uh, we have uh, like uh, four uh, choices here or uh, four uh, distinct uh, programs the first is uh, gene prediction in bacteria, archaea, and metagenomes program. Uh, the second is gene prediction in eukaryotes program. The third is gene prediction in viruses, phages, and plasmids program. And uh, the last choice is a uh, program which is designed for uh, gene prediction in EST or expressed sequence tags and cDNA. Uh, which uh, is uh, DNA uh, version of uh, mRNAs. Okay. Uh, in this tutorial, I'm going to use a software uh, called uh, Heuristic Models, uh, which is uh, which uh, corresponds to the analysis of uh, sequences from a new uh, genome or a new organism. Let's say that uh, you've sequenced a new uh, genome and you want uh, to locate open gradient frames. Well, uh, this uh, software is uh, for you, and uh, it's uh, for bacterial uh, or archaeal or metagenome only. Okay, uh, let's click uh, on uh, this software, which is Heuristic Models. Okay, this is uh, our software. In the input uh, sequence section, we can uh, type our uh, title here, which is uh, optional. This is uh, where we can paste uh, our uh, sequence and uh, I advise you to paste it uh, on, in raw format which uh, doesn't contain uh, the first line that have the accession number and the name etc. I have read the sequence here so we paste our DNA sequence here or we can uh, upload it uh, from a text file from here. Okay, uh, from uh, the output uh, options section we can enter our email address here. They say that uh, it's only required for graphical postscript outputs or uh, sequences longer than one million base pair. From uh, these four uh, options, the first option is uh, to generate. If we select uh, the first option, we can generate a PDF uh, graphics file that uh, I find it uh, very, very, very helpful and useful which have uh, a graphic uh, view, a graphical view of uh, our predicted uh, operating frames. 
The second option is uh, to generate a postscript graphics, which uh, requires, of course, uh, your uh, email address. The third option is to print GeneMark 2.4 predictions in addition to GeneMark.hmm predictions. And the fourth is uh, to translate predicted genes into protein. Okay, uh, to start uh, the program, we'll click on startGeneMark.hmm. And uh, we wait for the result page to appear. Okay, this is uh, a very uh, fast uh, software. So we can uh, click here to, to download uh, our uh, PDF graphical output, which uh, I've said that uh, it's uh, very, very, very useful. And here is uh, our uh, text uh, format. Uh, we have the length of our sequence here. We have the percentage of uh, G plus C. Okay, and uh, this is uh, the, these are uh, our predicted genes are five uh, predicted uh, genes, three on the positive strand and the two on the negative strand. Here is uh, the left end or the start codon. From where to where is, is the right end or the start codon. Is, uh, is, uh, our, here is uh, our gene length and here is uh, the class. Okay. Uh, this is uh, all uh, for today. If uh, you want to use uh, other softwares which are designed for eukaryotic uh, genomes or viruses, etc., uh, you can uh, use uh, other versions uh, of, uh, uh, of GeneMark program. And uh, as I said before, this is uh, all uh, for today. I hope uh, you enjoyed uh, this uh, tutorial. Uh, for more information about uh, bioinformatics and bioinformatics tutorials, uh, you can uh, visit uh, my uh, blog at bioinformatics-made-easy.blogspot.com. Thank you for listening.